Capricorn, you are now ready to put your legacy in the making. You're ready to move on to your key objectives in life, not just your key objectives this week or this month or this quarter, in life, okay? And for you to be in a nice flow uh, as far as where you're going towards those key objectives and legacy in the making, the full moon in Aries says you must release and reset issues that prevent you from having emotional security, issues that keep you from having homeland nutrition. In other words, emotional things that you are harboring uh, that disrupt your overall security. You're still p you know, pissed off about what your landlord said or you're still upset about what your kids did to the backyard. Allowing that to fester and continue uh, is actually part of uh, what's throwing off the security. Now, homeland nutrition is, am I absorbing and getting the things I need in my homeland environment? And so you want to release things that prevent you from really being nourished, emotionally comforted in your homeland situation. Now, the square to Mars says that for you to have this legacy in the making, the way your ego, Mars, responds to your marriage, responds to your partners, the way your ego responds in those areas, it's, it's stirring up emotion, but it's not settling things and making things better. And so it's making things to some degree worse. So uh, be willing to respond differently to your feelings about marriage and partnership. And the Pluto dozer, of course, is hitting you right in the action of character, behavior, and how you respond to yourself. You have, you know, the lines aren't very clear or the rules aren't very clear in that capacity. So just be flexible in character and your behavior, which includes what you initiate and how you respond. That's also technically your behavior. It's serious joy, joy, joy.